All right, Coach, I know you're not the outcome you guys are hoping for tonight. Uh, just kind of the, the initial thoughts and takeaways. Yeah, I mean, it's disappointing when you get this far. You know, you get to the semis, you're hoping to make it to, to Pinnacle, but we just came up short. I, I told the girls, I'm really proud of you. I've heard, you know, it's just tough. I mean, why not's why not? And they, you know, they have, what, seven seniors, brought a lot of girls back from last year. Um, you know, they're just pressured, just kind of overwhelmed us there. And offensively, we struggled that first half. So it's disappointing, but uh, proud of the girls' effort. Yeah, new coming in, it was probably going to be physical. And going into the second, it was tight game. And then they outscored you guys like 14 to 4. Uh, what did they do or what did you guys not do in the second? Yeah, I thought, you know, we talked about getting off to a good start, just, you know, getting used to that pressure and getting settled in against. And I thought we were okay early on. Uh, we weren't scoring, but neither were they. And then we just couldn't get much going on offense. You know, they switched everything. We just couldn't space out. I thought there was a couple times we got to the rim. Gentry McKinley just came up short a little bit. And then they hit some shots. I don't know how it all went down there, but they spaced us out, hit some shots, hit some threes there, and got a little lead and got into their press. And it just it was frustrating because we were just having a hard, such a hard time getting shots off on our end. Yeah, defensively, um, I don't know the exact number. I think they created some like 21 turnovers. Uh, what were they doing defensively? Well, I mean, it's just who they are. I mean, you know it's coming. It's full court press. They're going to switch everything. They're going to run and jump everything. I mean, we knew that. We, we tried to space them out and just let our girls kind of go one-on-one -on -one there. But we just had some sloppy turnovers there. Uh, unfortunately, our offense just wasn't good enough. Yeah, uh, I mean, how frustrating is that to have the offense kind of go the way it went tonight? <laughs> well, I mean, we saw that Wednesday night too, but I mean, it's it's hard to play why not. I mean, we've done it for 12 or whatever years, and we, we know what they do. I mean, they do it to everybody just with – it's tough. You know, we're playing five, six girls, and they're bringing in girls at every horn, which kind of wears you down. And then when you're not scoring, you know, it's hard to get back and play defense. They got us in transition there a few times as well. But, uh, you know, it was just it was just – not a good matchup for us this year with our youth, you know, with all their experience coming back. Obviously a, a tough one to take. What was the locker room like? Oh, they're disappointed. You know, that happens when you invest so much into it. It's tough for McKinley. You know, McKinley's a senior and she fouled out early, so she was disappointed. But, you know, that's going to be part of it. Just told them we're proud of their effort. They battle. You know, we a lot of people didn't know if we could get this far this year. But, you know, to get to the semis again, to have a good year, um, just proud of how they competed all year.